What is up? Matthew Moore here for the first Friction 2, a whole lot of EDM for December 14, 2018. Let's get started with the first track, Glitch by Martin Garrix and Julian Jordan. Uh, 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 uh. Martin Garrix? Not bad, holy shit. Like, I could see even, like, above and beyond playing this. Some really great layers in here, very, very pretty. For a simple progressive house song, I really enjoyed it. Next up is Mixed Signals by Rez and Blank. Yes, I do like this quite a bit. Ooh. So that's two in a row for Blank. Really big fan of this song, Rusty of like early Electro House just by how raw it is. This song I think is a lot of fun. Like it just has enough melody, but also it's gritty enough where, you know, all the bass heads can really enjoy it. Next song is Hope by The Chainsmokers. This is cool. The beginning was kind of boring, just sort of like really basic percussion, but this whole vocal kind of thing kind of reminds me of what Zed does usually on his tracks. I don't know, this drop sounds kind of Kind of like a demo, like it doesn't. It's like not pulling me in so hard like other tropically house songs. I don't think it lends to Chainsmokers' strengths. It, in fact, it kind of makes them sound sort of like, you know, Batoma, Kaigo, and a lot of other contemporaries that tend to work in that sort of pop electronic scene. Not a huge fan of the song. Next up is Affliction by Tiesto and Zach. Oh, featuring Ninja, of course. Okay. <laughs> this build is so weak. What is going on? All right, I'm not. I'm not playing video games. This. Oh, these drums are so bad. All right. Essentially, this is like really, really bad. <laughs> Elenium, really, really bad. San Holo, really, really bad. Just future bass from Tiesto. This is a skip. This is this is not worth anyone's time. Next up is All of You by Prince Paris. Clean. Let's see how the drop is. That's, that's what's going to decide this one for me. Hey, not bad. Cute percussion. I think it blend really well with the vocal, I think. I think all the elements in the song really are complementing each other quite well. Maybe not the track for me, or maybe I'm just kind of looking for something a little bit more of an X factor, something a little bit more unique. It's kind of a hard cap just because it's doing nothing too unique or whatever. Next up is You Remind Me by Griffin. Great vocal performance so far. Really soulful. Seems like all the other elements of the song are pretty much backing to the vocal, which is a bad thing because this guy's going ham. There's all sorts of different riffs and melodies that he's going for. Yeah, I mean, drops okay. I don't know. I don't know why it's not so danceable. Maybe just because of the transition from the build to the drops, a little weird. Next up is "How Do You Turn This Thing On" by Virtual Riot. Oh, okay, this is pretty. Am I playing the song? This is a virtual art song. This is interesting. It's like a Medeon track or some shit. What? This is so cute. Never mind. Yeah, everything's going on with the pretty stuff in this song. A1. Like, so it's got the bass stuff that, you know, you'd love if you're a Virtual Riot fan, but then it has all this extra pretty Electro House stuff and Progressive House stuff that you don't usually get from Virtual Riot, so I think it's a great change up, but also still appealing to his core. Next up is Strut by UK. Kind of reminds me of that build to that, uh, Trap Odessa song. I like all these like animally sort of like vowely sounds, but you know it's not fitting into like you know 
anyone else's pocket. At least the next iteration of like some of the harder stuff that OK was making like a couple years ago. But it seems to be a bit more refined, a lot more switches up and in, in the sounds. It's like OK gone uh, Barong sound almost, which is like super sick. Last song is Heart Attack by Lossy. Lossy? Hey, you know, he's probably Norwegian or something, so it's probably even neither of those. Pretty, pretty epic. I like how hyper and expressive it is, but it's like also still catchy and not like too crazy, like a G. Jones song or something. But it's crazy though. This, this is, this is wild and cool. Nice. So this is the kind of song you make if you're a really capable and creative producer. Uh, I'm not too familiar with Lossy. Uh, in fact, it's my first song ever hearing of him, but. Uh, really excited to hear more of him, or her. So that was all the brand new EDM, or at least I hope most of it, for <laughs> December 14, 2018. Let me know what you guys thought about the songs below. If you missed any songs, also let me know. Everyone, good luck on your finals week if you're currently in school. I'll see you guys next time.